Utah State University's pilots in training are back flying over the desert landscape of the San Rafael Swell in southeastern Utah after rapid growth in Cache Valley. USU's aviation program had a temporary presence in Price during World War II and into the 1990s. Fast forward to 2019, and the runway in Logan is crowded with the program growing from 160 students to 360 in five years. Northern Utah gets more snow, and the inversion can be difficult when training new pilots. Carbon County has ideal flying conditions almost year-round. USU Eastern has smaller class sizes, less air traffic, and lower tuition rates, including the aviation program. Students receive the same training as students at the Logan campus, even though the first two years are spent in Price. Ashley Martinez was raised in Price and dreamed of becoming a pilot since she was a little girl. And then for my 15th birthday, my mom bought me a plane ticket to San Antonio to go visit um, our aunt. And that very first flight, because I've never been on a plane before, before that, that was what solidified it. Once I took off and I was like, man, this is what I want to do. I, I get to see things nobody else gets to see on a regular basis, and I just love that. Growing up in Price and graduating from USU's aviation program, Martinez takes pride in seeing this new program succeed. The aviation program in Price is new, but Martinez is impressed with the group of young pilots. The group of students we have, they are just extremely motivated students. They're on top of their homework. They're actually working ahead of the schedule to keep flying and they're pushing themselves and they, they're just a wonderful group of students. So I'm seeing successes in every single flight with these kids. Most of USU Eastern student population come from Carbon County and surrounding areas, but part of that population come from as far as Anchorage, Alaska, like aviation student Eli McKenzie. After touring those places, you know, I, I went and did my, my tours and I kind of felt that, you know, a couple other places it felt like it was more, less of a student, more of like a number. And I just kind of felt like, you know, this was a smaller program. I felt like there was more like one-on-one -on -one with your instructor. Most aviation students don't just decide to become a pilot. It's something they dream of for years. The Alaska native felt pressure to enroll in other schools, but he knew he wouldn't get to fly a plane until after his first year, on top of higher tuition rates. Many of USU Eastern's programs concentrate on providing quality education with hands-on experience to prepare students to enter the workforce as soon as possible, a workforce highly needed for communities in Price and around the world. Pathways like the aviation program are leading students like McKenzie and alumni like Martinez to careers that build communities. It's hard work, I, I understand, but I couldn't see myself doing anything else and I just love it. 